guys so today i have a very very exciting video i have a room tour and i've been wanting to do a room tour for the longest longest time but i knew i had some stuff to get done in my room and it is finally complete and i know you guys didn't request this video but personally i wanted to do this video for me because i am leaving on sunday for college and i will be in a new room which is kind of crazy to think about but it is a way smaller room than my room here at home so you know i wanted to do a video because i am going to take some of the decorations with me and i'm pretty sure my room is going to change from here to whenever i'm home you know i didn't quite finish exactly everything that i wanted to do in my room but i'm content with it um my room makes me really happy so i hope you guys enjoy I had a ton of fun filming it i filmed it like 2009 to like 2012 status where they literally show you everything it's not like the newly edited room tours it's kind of like the old style ones so i hope you guys enjoy it it's probably going to be long i haven't edited it yet so i think it's going to be long but hopefully you stay tuned till the end so without making it any more longer let's get right into it Okay, so the first thing I'm going to do is give you guys an overview of my entire room. It might be kind of hard to fit everything in the frame, but I'm going to try my best. And the lighting is about to get a lot of crazy because of the Christmas lights and my studio light. So beware. And there I am. Hello guys. So starting off with my door. Everyone starts off with their door. There's nothing really exciting about it. Like I don't have anything behind it. The only exciting thing is probably that I don't have a doorknob. And that's why it's all dirty right there and disgusting. Um, so um, yeah, this is my closet. And on top of my closet, I have this banner. And honestly, this banner was technically not supposed to be there. I made it for my cousin's bridal shower and I just, I kept it up there. And my closet is a fairly big size. I only have one door because I broke the other door. So yeah, it's pretty organized, I would say. I have some boots up there, some other shoes, a storage box with all my beanies and winter stuff up there, and then some shoe boxes. And my clothes is pretty organized. I have jackets, dresses, skirts. And so on this side, I have my denim, my sweaters. Um, they're all my dressy sweaters, not my casual ones, but just the ones that are dressy. <laughs> and then over here, I have my scarves, and I have one, two, three, four, I have five hang- wait, six hangers filled with scarves, yeah. And then at the bottom, I just have my shoe wrap that I got at Dee Dee's, and then my sandals, and yeah. And the rest of this side has some backpacks, a box filled with all of my fabric. And then this thing is supposed to be for a DIY, but I broke my mirror. You guys will probably see it later, but yeah, I never got around to it. And moving on, it's to my closet. I have my dresser. And as you guys can probably tell, it's like all weird. And that is because it was actually wood wood, but I just spray painted it and I did sand it down. Cause I was too lazy. And on top of my dresser I have these buckets from the dollar section at Target. And then I have my brush and all my beauty stuff for my hair. Um, some lotion. And I have a picture of my cousin. I actually never met him but he disappeared a couple years ago and my grandma told me to keep his picture here so that is the reason that it's in here. And then I have my lamp which has no actual light in it but it serves as a cute decoration and then these are necklaces but they actually go on 
some sandals. And when I want the sandals to just be white, I take these off. So yeah, they're off. I haven't put them on yet, so I keep them right here so I don't lose them. And then over here, I have my coat rack, which doesn't hold any coats. But the little decoration up here is actually made by my cousin's wife. She made them for my cousin's baby shower. And I just took them home because they match my room and they're pretty. But yeah, I have my backpack. And then I have my purse, which is from Tommy Hilfiger. I have a what's in my purse if you want to go check that out. I will link it. And then moving on, I have this board and I got this board at Michael's for $5. It was on sale. I really like it. I made this like inspiration board with like practically all my YouTubers. There's like Bethany Moda. And then I have my Christmas ticket. And then this is a card I got from when I went to youth camp. My counselor made like a little note. And it goes so cute. And then moving on, I have my magazine rack that Jasmine gave me and then I have my nightstand and then I have some PJs up there and then at the bottom I have some casual cardigans and then on top of my nightstand I have a candle and this is one of my favorite candles from Walmart and it is the hazelnut cream candle and then I have two journals um, this one actually got for Christmas from Jasmine one year and then the other one I bought from Walmart. And then I have a picture of me with my best friends. This is Jasmine, obviously. You guys probably know who she is. And my best friend Chris and my friend Jerry. And then moving on, I have my bed area. Okay, so starting off with my bed, I have a towel. Well, actually two towels. I have a face towel and my regular towel. And then I have this blanket that is actually in a DIY video and I will link it down below. You guys can go watch that, but I made the pom-poms on the blanket. And then my comforter is actually from Target. I got it last year and it is reversible. Some days I like to put this print and then other days I like to keep that one because it's a little bit more clean. Um, and then these pillowcases I made myself. And then on top of my bed I have all of this. I have this dream catcher, it's pretty plain and I'm actually going to redo it. But I needed something there so I made it like literally really quick. I have this sign that I made in one of my DIY videos with my YouTube name. I have these twinkle lights that I got at Target for like three bucks. And then I have this painting that I seriously, seriously love and Jasmine did it for me. And I don't know, I think it just goes really well with my room and she did such a good job. And I'm totally, totally taking that with me. Like I can't leave that behind. So. I need to find something to put there, but that's going with me for sure. And then I have this sign that I got in Sacramento like two years ago, and it just says dream big, which is why I put it above my bed because that is where I dream. <laughs> and then up here I just have a sketch that I printed out. And then over here I just have another wall art kind of thing. It's a scrapbook paper that I put in a frame. Yeah, that's pretty simple to do. And then over here, I've had this banner for so, so, so long. All these pictures are really outdated. They are from high school. They are from my senior year in high school. Then I have my lights with my curtains and lighting's weird but whatever so this is the other half of my room and as you guys can tell over here I have my light with 
which I have on so the lighting can be a little better. And I just have some scarves up there, which really go with my room too. So yeah, I have those. Okay, so this is my desk right here. So yeah, starting off with the chair so we can get rid of it. Um, my room used to be zebra, so I never actually got rid of this. And it's a broken chair too, so yeah. I was supposed to get rid of that a long time ago. So, starting from the top, I have these cork boards that I put fabric over and as you can tell that that fabric is the same as the banner and I just have a ton of pictures with all my friends so, so there I have a picture with me Jasmine and Chris and then a picture with me Jasmine and her knees and then a little note Jasmine leaves for me sometimes in my room and then right below it, I have this one, which has some of these pictures. Uh, these are from the movies, and then this one's of me and Miriam at the fair. And Miriam just went off to college as well, so it's pretty exciting. And me and Jasmine, again, and a picture of Bethany Moda. And this is an invitation of Jasmine's niece. This is a painting of her, and that is her right there. And this was at her first birthday party, and this was for her second birthday party. So, yeah. And then in this one, I just have some pictures from graduation, which was like three years ago. So there's a picture of me when I was a baby or in kindergarten. And then a picture of me and my cousin Nieves. And then Chuck Bass, because I'm obsessed. And then a picture of me, Jazz, and Barb. And in the, in the last one, I have a picture of me and Jazz again, of course, and another note she left for me. She's like the sweetest. And then I have another picture of me and Chris and a note that, well, it's called a compliment and we made it in our sociology class. And yeah, that is what he wrote. And right here, I have my DIY calendar that I did in one of my DIY videos. And then I have my laptop. And then right here I have a binder. And on top of it I have my adapter for my phone. And then behind my laptop I have another picture of me, Chris, and Jazz. I have a ton of pictures of those guys, I'm sorry. And then I have the Target dollar bins with all my supplies. These supplies are technically just for my home use. I have my school one separate, but yeah, um, those are it. And then underneath, I, I have all my sticky notes for notes. And then I have my printer over here with random papers in here. And then I have the scrapbook paper cutouts because I'm gonna do a DIY, but I'm not gonna do it until I move, but yeah. And then I have this picture my cousin made for me for my birthday last year, and that's her, that's me when we were little, my brother, me, and her. And then I have the case from the Bethany Moda perfume because I think it's really cute, and the teal or the turquoise goes with my room. And then I have this little organizer that I got at the Dollar Tree with my glasses cases and some random body wash and just random stuff. And then in my drawer, I have even more stationery. I have my portable charger, my thing that goes for my tripod for when I film, and then just random stuff. And then underneath my drawer, here I have this thing one of my aunts made for my birthday with my name on it. And inside of it I have um, erasers, lead, and glue sticks. And then in this pouch, I actually made this. This is, this is my pencil pouch. I think I made it like last year or two years ago. I think two years ago. And I have all my actual school supplies. 
that I got for this year in here and I'm gonna pack those up and then behind there I just have a bunch of index cards and then over here I have more notebooks that I'm probably gonna use I have my planner and my church planner more notebook and underneath I have my high school yearbook and then this is actually a textbook and then the rest of these are binders right here these two right here are my fashion class portfolios from high school so I have all my fashion stuff here and I'm actually gonna take them with me because I might need them and then this one is just filled with a bunch of school stuff from the years and then this is my scrapbook paper that I love and then over here I have that broken mirror I was telling you guys about stepped on it and now I can't make what I wanted to make and I think it just broke more not cool and then I have my trash can that I think I got this at the dollar thing as well so yeah I'm gonna have my laptop adapter and then I have this like book organizer that I made from I think it was an oatmeal box but yeah so uh, over here I have this is like my sewing area it's up I tend to move my sewing machine to my desk now because there's like no room for me to like sit over here but up here I have these two canvases that I made and it just says not all who wonder are lost and then this like sort of dream catcher I don't know if it looks like one but <laughs> yeah I made that and then this is a clipboard that I made and I just put scrapbook paper and tape over it and I spray painted it from up here and then I keep scraps of scrapbook paper on it for whenever I need to use scrapbook paper and then I have my sewing machine it is the brother LS2000 I don't know it was pretty fine and then I have these things I made in my fashion class my senior year and they're like pattern weights um, so yeah I have that and this is like my least organized area guys I'm sorry but I have this like bucket that had a bunch of little scissors and now I'm stuck with one and then this is the one with the big scissors and then over here I have cutting mats more banners and my laptop case and then in this drawer I have a bunch of sewing stuff in here and yeah it's unorganized like I said and then right here I have some colored pencils markers some art stuff and then I have my little case here that has a bunch of thread and then this like mini portable sewing machine it actually works it's pretty cool and then moving on to the last area of my room this is my little photo gallery thing and then I have this cubicle organizer um, but yeah these are all my pictures and I made these pom-pom theme a while back but yeah these are pictures of my friends my family and I love it. I'm thinking about taking it, but I'm not entirely sure. I actually want to print out new pictures. But yeah, getting onto the organizer, I have this watch holder that I made in one of my videos, and then some more watches right here. And then this is actually a box that I covered with scrapbook paper. Seriously, scrapbook paper is like. But it used to be red and I don't know what's in here. Oh, and I have these things I got at a baby shower and a movie ticket from Avengers. Such a good movie. And I have these from Jasmine's niece's birthday party. It was a Tiffany and Co. thing. And then this I made for my cousin's bridal shower, or actually 
Jasmine made them. Gotta give her the credit. She made these and they came out amazing. And I just have some candy in there. And then this thing. And then moving on to the actual cubicle thing. I have another magazine holder thing right there that I made. And then my sunglasses and some phone cases. And then in this one, I actually got these at the Dollar Tree. And now they actually have the full size ones, which I might get and take these with me. I'm not sure yet. But in here, I just have a bunch of like Madison stuff, some veils from church. But this is like my most random one with like Madison and crap. <laughs> yeah. And then on this one, I have all my hair accessories. I have my headbands. Right here and right here, and then a bunch of bows and more headbands. And then right here, I have another one of these. And this one has all of my DIY stuff, and these are tickets for when we do Apple's at church. But other than that, everything's like DIY stuff, especially like new stuff. But yeah, it's like my DIY drawer. And then over here, I have all my lotions and body sprays hand sanitizers yeah this is like my beauty section okay so in this drawer i think a lot of it is like sewing stuff i have ribbon i have this thing right here with like fabric samples i'm totally taking that with me and then in here i have let's see i have the zippers I have to take all this stuff with me because I don't know if I'm going to need them. And then down here I have books. I have my Lauren Conrad book that Jasmine got me for my birthday last year. Um, my junior high yearbook. And just some random books. And then in this drawer I have more sewing stuff. I have these hoops. And then some patterns make clothes and more patterns and then moving on to the last cubicle I have these boxes and in this one I have a bunch of tapes and these glue things for my hot glue gun so yeah, these are all my tapes a little washi tape and as you guys can tell I use this tape to cover all my boxes and this one was a converse box, and you guys can't tell. <laughs> and then in this one, this, these two boxes are exactly alike, and they came with my perfume, which is this one. My Can Can by Paris Hilton, when I buy my kits, they come in a box, and they are perfect for storage. But in this one, I have my hot glue gun, and paint, and feathers. But yeah, this, this one, I have all my acrylic paints. And then in this box, it is my memory box. I have letters from Chris. I have um, pictures from my graduation. And yeah, I'm, and yeah, I literally have so many things. It is my memory box with. A bunch of stuff I've gotten from friends and stuff, so yeah. That is my memory box. There. And then I really don't want to go in front of the mirror, but this mirror is like everybody loves this mirror in my room because it's huge and it's perfect for OOTDs and just random stuff like that. But yeah, this is my handy dandy mirror that I'm gonna make. But yeah, guys, that is my room. I'm gonna give you guys another overview of my room. But yeah, I'm really gonna miss this room. I worked so hard on it. And yeah, we'll see you soon, room.